We're on the line with Michael Bartlett, director of both Zombie Diaries, The Paranormal Diaries, Clop Hill, and the new suspense thriller, Treehouse, now available to stream or download at thehorrorshow.tv. So Michael, tell us about Treehouse. So the film basically is it's a coming of age story um, about a young man named Killian, who's uh, about 16 years old, and he's one of these kids that he lives in his brother's uh, shadow. You know, his brother fights all his battles for him, his older brother Crawford. Uh, there's a lot of scenes at the beginning you see where we establish this and see the bullies. And then the idea is that they uh, they go into the woods to meet some local girls, which is, you know, very formulaic. We've kind of seen that stuff before. But then I wanted to pivot the whole film on its head and give the audience something very, very original. Um, and originality is very important to me. When I made Zombie Diaries, no one had ever done anything like that before. Now, of course, cinema verite films are everywhere, or as they call them, found footage films. And I thought the Paranormal Diaries was very original when we made that, although obviously we did take a lot of inspiration from Ghost Watch. And so that's kind of what drew me to Treehouse as a, as a script and a story, was just I felt like I'd not seen it before. There was elements that, that I could identify with, such as the siege mentality, and I studied many siege movies when I was in the process of writing this. So I watched Tremors, I watched um, Assault on Precinct 13, and even Frozen, even though that film takes place on a ski lift, to me, you know, they're circled by the walls, and in many respects it is a, you know, we're stuck in one place and we've got to get out and we've got to make plans on how to get out. So, um, yeah, that, that's kind of what it is. It's just a very original, um, uh, spooky suspense thriller. I think that people should know in advance that it's not really a horror film in the terms that you're not going to get lots of blood, you're not going to get lots of action. Um, that's one of the reasons why I, I, I kind of uh, was nervous about the potential of showing it at Fright Fest because I didn't want people thinking that it was a horror film and then tearing it to pieces because that's certainly not what it was intended as. It's more, it really, the way I describe it, it's almost like a feature-length version of one of those Alfred Hitchcock Presents episodes. It's just a weird, strange film that's very, very different if that's what people are looking for. Treehouse is available to stream or download at thehorrorshow.tv and if you download it for $7.99 you'll get a bonus copy with exclusive director's commentary not available anywhere else.